about before we get started is about what tap dancing, what it really means to me if you're just starting out. To me, tap dancing is the merging of sound and movement together. And I think that that's a really important thing to keep in mind is that the sound and the movement are not separate things, but something that comes together. We're musicians who are dancing at the same time. And so with that in mind, I would love to take you guys through your first steps of tap dancing. After this 12 months, you'll be able to really be able to do quite a few things. And I can't wait to see you guys progress. Okay, so for our first lesson, we're not going to learn any particular step. All right, I think that, that oftentimes in tap dancing, we think about the steps first. And I want to introduce the concept of meter or time first. Now, the meter of any particular song is going to be the pulse. It's going to be the, the downbeat, which gives the piece its musical rhythmic structure. All right, so if we're just thinking about meter, everybody just find a beat somewhere with me. One, two, put it in your legs somewhere. Now put it in your hands. Put it like you snap. Put it in your chin. One, two, three. Put it in your shoulders. And one, two, three. Put it in your hips. And one, two, three, four. It's just a joke on the last one. But when you guys are dancing, before the music, when the music comes on, you should automatically find where the pulse is. You should never start dancing just out of nothingness. You should be connected because when you connect to the music, you're going to be connected to the life of the dance. And that's really what, what we're trying to find. So what we're going to do is a little exercise where we work on trying to put into our feet, we're going to go half the beat. So if the beat is one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, we are going to say one, two, three, four. So just step on the beat. Pick your knees up, right? Now, show me in your legs, show me one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. So now, can you simultaneously, while your feet are doing half the meter, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let me see separated. And one, two, three, four, one, one more time. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now let's try both at the same time. So you're gonna say one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Just see what that feels like. Now can you reverse the logic? So think your feet go one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. This is where you're assigning the meter to different parts of your body so you get the feeling of what the music feels like. This is going to improve your sound. It's going to improve your quality of keeping time. All right, you're going to hear a lot of time through your life as a tap dancer, the idea of keeping time. All right, and that's just keeping and holding that meter steady and, and right perfectly in place. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to basically do with some music. We're just going to, in our legs, we're going to go here, and we're going to keep it, and we're going to do a clapping exercise. We're going to clap on the one, so we'll clap one, two, three, four, one, and we'll just clap on the one for a while. Then maybe we'll clap on the two. I'll call it out and say, all right, let's try the two. One, two, three, one, two, three. Every time you uh, hit a clap, sit into your body a little bit more. So if you say one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, we're just gonna do this with some music. So let's give this a try. So we're going to be working out right now to the tune uh, Thinking Out Loud by Ed Sheeran. And the beautiful part about this exercise is that you can practice it anywhere to any piece of music as long as it has a pulse to it. So practice all the time. Like even when you're just, at, just sitting at home and music's playing, you can even sitting in a chair, tap your foot, do this exercise all the time. So anytime you hear a song and you're practicing on this, it's going to make you more musical when you're dancing. All right, let's give it a try. When you're so where's that meter? It used to be full. Put in your legs for a second. Yeah, one, two. And I can't sweep you off of your feet. Where's the double time? And one, two. Will your mouth still remember the taste of my love? Yeah, half time? 
Will your eyes still smile for Now me one half time into your feet. Done in a Right. 